Hello and welcome back to another GeoGuessr video and in this one I thought I want to try something new, something different with all the AI advances. Uh, I wanted to do something AI related and since I like to use Midjourney to generate images, they recently released a new option to describe the images that we provide. So I thought, can I use it to kind of describe what we see and maybe it can help us figure out which countries we are uh, at. So I have no idea how it will go, probably not too well, but we can try. So we're going to play some community world, no moving, panning, zooming. Um, so yeah, uh, let's, let's get going. Let's get going. So right away, not too much to see here. The bollard looks Spanish uh, with the, this, this kind of little number on the top, the, the shape, the little gap at the top um, should be a Spanish bollard. So I would guess Spain here, but let's see. Let's take a quick screenshot. Uh, of this and see what the uh, mid journey bot says so it gives us four descriptions um it does the first one does say an empty road in southern spain so um i don't know how it got that it was spain does the bot recognize bollards or something but uh it does mention southern spain um i don't i don't know where in spain i would have guessed but i'm gonna trust the trust the bot and let's guess southern spain um Genuinely, it's a better guess than I would have made, because I probably would have guessed more northern. <laughs> so, um, AI is coming for us. Uh, so, okay. Needless to say that uh, using any sort of external assistance, even this one in competitive mode, will get you banned. So, don't even try. But, okay, this one, next one. What do we have here? First of all, where would I have guessed here? It looks like we're driving the left side. Maybe Australian? I'm actually not sure. I think... I think I would have gone Australia with this flat landscape. Hard to see in which direction the sun is, but uh, with driving left, this wouldn't be South Africa uh, with the, these road lines. This this doesn't feel like UK or Ireland. I'm, I think Australia makes the most sense. So let's see what the bot says. It does say in the first description, it does say Australian landscape. Does it mention anywhere specific where in Australia uh, we might be? I, I don't think so, but it does say Australia, so let's go with Australia. I'm genuinely surprised how well the bot is doing uh, when it comes to recognizing countries. I, I'm not sure where in Australia this will be. Not I'm not very good with region guessing, but let's go somewhere here-ish, maybe. Okay, more north. It was Queensland, but okay. Uh, next, what? So okay, where would I guess here? We are... Driving on the left side, I think. Generation 4. I'm thinking Malaysia, but I'm not super sure. I would have I would have gone Malaysia here, but let's see, let's see what the uh bot is telling us. Okay, so the bot is saying Thailand. I actually had Thailand in mind as a second guess, but I don't know, the road lines felt a bit off. I wasn't sure about that sign in the distance, but the bot is saying Thailand uh, in a couple of the, the um, prompt options there. So Northern Th Thailand in particular. No, we, we do have some mountains on here on the left side, as you can see. So uh, yeah, let's guess Northern Th Thailand then, because it can get quite, quite mountains there. Ah, it was Malaysia. I was right this time. I was right this time. <laughs> I was right. So you can't trust the bot uh, every single time. It was mainland Malaysia. Uh, and I would have gone mainland Malaysia because it was generation 4. I don't think you can uh, have generation 4 on the island of Borneo unless they've added it recently, which I don't think they have. Ooh, there is really little to go by here. Uh, so I will be really impressed if the bot guesses this one correctly. Uh, where would I go? I actually don't know where I would go here. There is really little information. I'm not even sure about the continent, to be fair. And uh, overcast weather, the uh, a little bit hilly, it seems. I'm thinking somewhere in Americas, maybe. Um, could this ever be northern Colombia or somewhere in Mexico, maybe? I'm thinking somewhere in that area, maybe, but... I genuinely don't know, but let's see what the bot uh, what the bot says. 
Okay, the bot says Brazil. I see the fourth prompt is saying Brazil. Brazil is definitely not a bad guess. I could easily see this being Brazil as well. Maybe somewhere northeast, maybe somewhere there. I don't notice it's saying anything where in Brazil it might be. So let's go somewhere in Brazil. I, I would guess somewhere up here then if it's Brazil. Let's see. Okay, it was a... No, it was Peru. Okay. It was... Okay, it makes sense as well. So, I was right about it being America's bot was also sort of right about the continent at least. But this was a really tricky round, I thought. I wouldn't have gotten the country right myself either. This was very American in, at the first glance, but uh, let's see if, if bot guesses it right. Google Street View of the Withworth Bridge. Where the hell is Withworth Bridge? No way, it actually guesses the right bridge. I, I, I don't believe that. But River Creek Bridge in Tulsa. Tulsa, okay. So the fourth guess says Tulsa in particular. The third guess is saying Kootenay, British Columbia. So uh, we're getting some mixed messages here. One prompt is saying British Columbia. Another one is saying Tulsa. The second one is saying Whitworth Bridge, but I don't know where that is. Uh, this doesn't feel like British Columbia, but where was Tulsa? I, I don't remember where was Tulsa, so we gotta find it first. Oh, here is Tulsa. Okay. I, I thought it was quite southern. Okay, it was Oklahoma, apparently. I hope that's the right Tulsa. So, I don't know if this feels like Oklahoma, but let, let's trust the uh, bot. Okay. <laughs> it was very wrong. Uh, it was all the way in eastern Canada. Definitely not the Withward Bridge either, but <laughs> well, it was it was Canada, so the the British Columbia I guess would have gotten the country right at least. Let's see the results: ten thousand, which uh, for a bot recognizing still uh, images, I think it's pretty impressive. But let's go again. Let's let's go for another game. Uh, let's see if it can do better. Um, I would go probably Russia here. Because uh, this bollard, first of all, feels quite Russian. This sign, this M letter, feels Cyrillic. The Cyrillic M letters have a slightly different look to them. Um, I'm, I, and I'm guessing this is just like a temporary sign. Uh, you get them yellow. Not sure what this, um, this sign here is. Th that looks really, really interesting, unique. I don't think I've seen that one before. If anyone knows, let me know in the chat, uh, in the comments. But okay, let's, uh, let's see what the bot thinks about this one. It doesn't give us any country at all, I don't think. At least I don't see um, any country being mentioned. Uh, let's maybe try again. Um, let's let's have a maybe a wider shot this time. So to include the bollard and, and the, the signs and everything like this. It doesn't mention the country, I don't think, again. But it does mention Ivan Shishkin, which was a Russian painter. So, because of that, I think we can kind of assume Russia, maybe. Um, so, uh, I'm gonna go Russia, because I personally think it's Russia as well. I don't know where. Russia is hard to region. guess I would maybe go kind of Western-ish, maybe, but I don't know. Uh, I was just Central Russia. Uh, not a good guess, but, but Russia can be really tough to guess. Ooh, hello. Now, what is this? Uh, we have double yellow lines with kind of Nordic looking houses on the right side. I think this has to be like uh, US, maybe Canada. These uh, poles would be um, North American with this little teeny tiny tip at the top. Um, if I had to guess, I would have guessed I actually don't know where I would have guessed. It's definitely North America, but would it be like Montana or something, maybe? I, I, I don't know. With this dark, dark soil, could it ever actually be like... Um, I think Pre Prince Edward Island had the kind of darkish soil, no? Maybe? Um, I'm not sure. Let's see what the bot thinks, yeah. I don't think the... Um, Bot is very helpful this time. I don't see any uh, countries mentioned at all or anything that could really help here. So let's go, I don't know, let's go with Prince Edward Island because because maybe, I don't know. Let's see. Okay, not too bad actually, not too bad. It was close, close to there. 
So, okay, I I'm happy with my, my guess. No help from bot this time. Uh, let's see what's what's happening here. So without the 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 any AI, I would guess hmm, quite hilly. I was thinking like, could this be Ecuador or something with the yellow line in the middle as well? Maybe Brazil. I don't know about Brazil. I guess Ecuador was was the first thing that came to my mind, but I'm not very confident though. Okay, the AI is super specific this time. Road 66 to the Nagarua Canyon in Bolivia. Super specific. <laughs> but, okay. Is the road 66 even a thing in Bolivia? Because I don't see anything close to 66. So that might be something that AI just came up with. Yeah, I can't find the road 66. Let's just guess somewhere. Um... In the middle-ish here is maybe somewhere a bit more east. It was, oh, it was Peru, but super close to Bolivia, to be fair. Is there road 66 there? No. <laughs> no, there isn't. But still, not too bad. It was, it was closer than my guess would have been, because I would have guessed with the, it went with Ecuador. And, okay, this is New Zealand, with the driving on the left side. These road lines you can see in New Zealand yellow with white dashes. These are New Zealand bollards as well. So, uh, for me, this would be an easy, easy New Zealand guess. Um, let, let's see what, if, if AI recognizes this one. Well, it doesn't mention New Zealand by name, I don't think. But it does mention Maori. Maori art in the first um, description. Maori are the indigenous people of New Zealand, so it is quite specific um, for AI to mention. So I think just based on that, we can go with New Zealand. Yeah, third one also mentions Maori, and second one as well. So so yeah, we can we can go with New Zealand because of that. I think Northern Southern Island. Uh, I would guess northern, probably. Kind of a hillier part of the northern. Oh, oh, nice. Good guess. Good guess. I'm happy with that. And last but not least, what is this? These po these signposts kind of remind me of Colombia. I'm not sure what this sign says. I, I don't think I can read it on my monitor. We have a yellow, uh, yellow line in the middle. It mentions southern countryside a lot, but... Uh, Southern countryside of which country? U.S.? Does it mean U.S.? Southern countryside, English countryside. It's not U.K. for sure. Um, should we go U.S. because of that? Let's let's try a different um different like like framing. Scottish landscapes? No, they are not. No, they are not. This is the first time I definitely disagree with AI. <laughs> These are not Scottish landscapes. Yeah, let's go with, um, AI isn't helping me on this one. Let's go with, let's go with Colombia. I don't know. It was Colombia. Okay, so those were Colombian signs. I thought they kind of reminded me of those. So, um, AI would have done worse. <laughs> Well, all in all, it actually did better than I expected it to do. Still, long way to go, but uh, some, some really good guesses there. Again, quick reminder that using external existence is prohibited when playing against others. And yeah, uh, if, let me know if you want to see some more AI-related content. And on the right side, there will be another video I think you will enjoy. Huge thanks to all of the patrons and YouTube members for supporting this channel. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day. Be kind to one another and see you all in the next video.